hello ladies and welcome back to my channel if you're new here i go by adele adele Villar. i hope you're all doing amazing in today's video i thought about showing you some zara items and get an overall conclusion if it's still worth shopping at zara and if their quality are decreasing Now ladies, before we get into this video, I know it's a bit of a reach, but we're almost getting to 10K. We're currently around 5,800 subscribers, but I would really love to get to 10,000 subscribers till the middle of April. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'll love for you to subscribe. And if you think anyone else that you know might be interested in this video, so make sure to send it over to them. Now, let's get right into this video. Ladies, I was really excited in getting this item and I was hoping that the quality wouldn't disappoint me that much. I really thought it's going to come in a flimsy tin material. It just looks very inexpensive, but I must say it is quite the upper side. The material is thick and feels really good on it doesn't look inexpensive in my eyes apart from the belt the quality of the belt is awful ladies what is zara thinking and of course there are some threads hanging out here and there remember it's still a zara item if you want a jumpsuit like this that comes in a better quality i think reese or caramel often sell similar pieces and styles like this but of course the price is a bit higher sizing wise it's quite accurate but i would recommend to size up since we're able to cinch in the waist with a belt an item like this looks really good on if it sits a bit more freely on the silhouette a spring summer item that can be worn to various occasions with heels or sandals and a hat on a summer vacation for instance and of course it will look so great with a blazer on a truly beautiful item with a moderate quality now these two items i saw on the model online and i thought it would be interesting to try them on so the trouser is a really popular zara item that they always bring back in stock in various colors and i must say it is one of the most flattering zara trousers out there and i get why it's so popular combined with this tight wrap top it's actually a nice combination the top is very stretchy but the arms are a bit short so i'm not sure if it's the style or maybe i should have sized up from how the top fits on i will not size up with it but i would recommend to size up with the trouser also if it has a bit of a stretch i really like how these two pieces complement each other and really gives a beautiful hourglass shape and i must say i like the quality of both of the pieces and they are quite versatile items as well the top here can be combined with any bottom pieces at all and will also look great over a dress and the trouser would be the perfect spring summer work trouser and will go with literally any top pieces i will say quality of both of the pieces are quite nice since we're getting into spring and it's getting more colorful outside i thought it would be interesting to showcase some colorful items that is one of the reasons i went for green this satin blouse has a really beautiful expensive looking green color that i find very flattering i love the v-neck line on it and it overall pairs so well with these green culottes now normally i have learned to stay away from zara satin blouses since the quality doesn't stand a chance to high-end labels with better satin pieces i would always recommend to go for good quality silk over satin anyway this satin piece let's say it's like every other zara satin buttoned on shirt the quality isn't that good and i just feel like my skin isn't able to breathe as much as it cooled otherwise i really like the fit style and color and trousers like these colors are easy to style in all four seasons in winter with long boots and in spring with pumps sandals or flats looking on how this trouser fits i should have went with the size medium it fits a bit tight around the waist and ties and also i really wanted to show you how beautiful a full monochromatic green outfit looks i absolutely love it and it will be such a perfect spring workwear outfit 
quality, you have heard my opinion about it. Now, I own a lot of dresses from Zara and I absolutely love them. And I think this one might be another addition to my Zara dress collection. I went for this satin slip dress because of the lace detail also if it slightly reminds me of a nightgown and with this dress i really like how it's sewn a bit tighter on the knee to bust it just sits a bit nicer on a silhouette this dress looks and feels really good on. and also this spring it will pair so well with this tweed jacket normally i love zara tweed jackets and blazers but this one here doesn't seem quite all right in my eyes in my eyes it looks quite inexpensive but i love the design of it and overall how it looks but the quality isn't really the best a well-made tweed jacket normally always elevates an outfit this one here would pair let's say very lovely with wide leg denims or trousers as well as skirts if you're interested in purchasing this i would recommend to size up so you will get the full benefits of wearing it as an outerwear this spring with thicker clothing pieces underneath and i would have loved this tweed jacket if the material was made out of better quality and the buttons would look a little bit more expensive or elevated looking but they look quite flimsy and that gives this tweed jacket an overall inexpensive look and yes you could switch out the buttons but for the pricing i won't say we could expect buttons and quality that are a bit more better so ladies we all know that denims are trending this year so we can't miss out on a denim dress so zara has had a couple of denim dresses the last few years and this year i decided to give another denim dress a try but i remember that i need to go up two sizes with your denim dresses and i must say i'm glad i did it's made quite well and looks and feels like an expensive high quality piece on i love Love that it's midi length but i need to say it feels a bit heavy on but it's a denim piece right ladies now while this piece is meant to be a dress it can also be styled as a trench coat with various pieces underneath and also i would say it is the best quality item so far in this haul i absolutely love wearing heels and i had to try on this pointed heel pumps i'm a heel lover and it has the perfect everyday comfy heel height 2.5 inches that are absolutely perfect for longer work days the material is made out of a diving suit fabric that is a nylon i guess although it looks like it's made out of a diving suit fabric i'm not quite sure if it will do well if you get caught in the rain with it overall they feel quite comfortable on so this pair of camel trousers with a matching belt already look like a good quality expensive item online on the website and guess what they do look high quality in real apart from the belt the material of the trouser is thick and luscious the color is a nice camel rich color so the fit in the size medium is just perfect i quite adore the overall tailored look of this pants the only deficit is the belt but that can be exchanged with better quality belts this trouser was paired with a satin a crew and navy blue striped button down shirt that i'm wearing into this video this satin shirt feels a bit thicker than the previous green satin shirt that I presented. So because of that, it feels and looks slightly more expensive and the quality seems to be a bit better as well. And ladies, you can't go wrong with pairing a strap satin shirt like this with a pair of camel trousers. It gives that elevated, expensive look and can be worn to various occasions such as horse riding or to work and will also look so great paired with a trench coat this spring now for some reason i've never tried on a zara trench coat before i was really searching for a trench coat that looked a bit thicker and therefore expensive online and this surely does check the boxes it's thick and looks expensive like it could be from a high-end brand it comes oversized so keep that in mind ladies i'm wearing the medium size here i adore the contrast of the beige color of the fabric combined with a deep 
black buttons and leather coating on the buckle of the belt, I truly feel like this would be an inexpensive alternative to the Burberry trench coats. And I think we all know that a trench coat is a wardrobe staple this spring. And this trench coat is worth checking out. Zara currently offers a variety of different trench coats on their website. So ladies, you can't believe how fast I clicked on purchasing this satin dress. And it looked amazingly good online. I could only get my hands on an extra small and I really hoped it would fit so I can present it to you in this video. And it gladly did. The way it sits on the frame with the tie rope detailing to cinch in the waist and the slightly high slit on the side of this dress and the overall style with the v-neckline is just beautiful. The slightly hanging material on the bottom half of this dress is perfect to hide a foot belly. The classy black leaf prints on this dress just adds to the elevated and sophisticated look of this dress. This would be the perfect spring summer event dress to wear on a sea venue for instance sipping some drinks and eating nice meals and looking or gorgeously rich but the quality of the material is an absolutely no go it's such a shame that they had to spare on good quality material for such a gorgeously and well-designed dress unlike this one here. So by now you may have noticed that Zara currently offers a lot of black and white printed pieces like this one here. Therefore, I had to obtain this printed blouse with a waterfall detailing on the front. Prints like this are classy and classic items that rarely goes out of style. This can be paired with white, black, or camel bottom pieces and will just add to that specialness to an outfit this spring and or summer. A truly beautiful piece with a decent thick satin material and in my opinion, the best satin piece in today's video. Now let's get to my overall conclusion. That will be you have to really search for good quality materials and items at Zara. And please ladies, do not get me wrong, but Zara is not that cheap as it is perceived. And for what we're spending our money on, we could for sure ask for better quality pieces, ladies. And yes, they offer better quality pieces that are made out of more sustainable materials now but why do we have to decide between cheap pieces for a bit lesser money and better quality for more money and honestly ladies i guess we all also got older and wiser and we're more aware of sustainable materials the good thing here is that the majority of the pieces from this video i will say i recommend to you ladies and you also hear the pieces i would not recommend and and yes, the quality has decreased. Is it still worth shopping at Zara? Yes, but with a good eye, ladies. That was very corny. But with that, I want to say thank you so much for watching. I really hope this video was helpful and enlightening. If it was, then make sure to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. If you haven't already, send this video to anyone out there you think that might find this video helpful and interesting and let's get to 10 ton subscribers as soon as possible till the middle of april that would be wonderful and i will see you in my next video goodbye